take a picture? No, no, hold it like that. It's recording live. We're on the video feed. Your big fingers are in there. Hold on. Where's the screen? Right there. Well, right. I see. I see. No, I see. I didn't know where my finger was in the way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to run through and take a picture, though, that everything's okay. It's a very easy process. There's a six-step process that you need to follow. You can get yourself that everything is absolutely okay. When you get home this evening, begin to look forward to the next upcoming season of American Idol and the upcoming seasons of 24 with Jack Bauer. We also have a new season of Family Guy, which will be debuting on Fox in approximately two months. In addition to that, make sure to continue to ignore history and continue to leave this show is entirely useless and boring and nothing to be learned from it. Thirdly, make sure to consume only food that is made by processed preparations. Food that is not organic, food that is genetically modified, and food that conflicts with your immune system. Ladies and gentlemen, freedom of speech is well and alive in Times Square! Yeah. NYPD Zero, we are changed and the love police three. We have we had three major attempts to shut down freedom of speech, but our God given humanity and our lives have prevailed today and we are allowed to speak to you with a message of love of truth. We are asking you to laugh, we are asking you to talk, we are asking you to live and breathe and not be over consumed by all these mega corporations. You have one life. Make it something meaningful. Make your life worth something. Be somebody in your life and follow your dreams. This is nothing but a big dream. Remember, what we have here today, our existence is temporary. Love and appreciate every second you have in this world and be nice and courteous to each other. There are lots of bullies. Bullies are only people who were hurt before. They are insecure. They are hurt. They are sometimes mostly police officers. They are the only ones who take the job because they're bullied in high school and now they can bully others. I am sorry, but I love people and I forgive them for their attempts to shut down freedom of speech. We send out love because they are human beings like us. They are brothers, they are sisters, they are doing their jobs. And we must respect each other in this world. And we respect them, but we have to understand we cannot let these uniforms get in the way of humanity. Our lives, our freedom, are much more important than a uniform or a law. Walking over to the, uh, on the, the authority right now. No, 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 no. I, I, I lost my job in the, you know, like, uh, 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 you know, I'm yeah. 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 I was wondering, because one thing we like to do is give police a hug. The hug is too personal. That's it. Too personal. Thank you. Thank you, guys. I know. Before you hug them, you got to say no homo in America. You got to say no homo and you no hug homo. them. Yeah, that's what you got to do. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, all the flashing lights you see, all the sparkle, all the glitter, all the sparkle, all the glitter. You gotta say no homo before you hug them in America. It's all here to hypnotize you. Tim Geithner, Ben Bernanke, and Mary Summers. Stay in one place, Daniel. They've been mad at me.